Hey, Mike with Rogue Pest Control here. And have you ever wondered what to do if you encounter gypsy moths and how to get rid of them? Well, today's video, I'm gonna go through a couple different tips you can use to get rid of gypsy moths and what to do if you find them around your home. Now, interestingly, these gypsy moths aren't really native species to the United States. Uh, they came over in about the late 1800s from typically Europe and Asia, and then they've spread across the U.S. ever since. Now, you might see the Department of Agriculture or maybe pest control companies treating for gypsy moths around your area. And the biggest thing is that they've been trying to keep these moths in check for almost 100 years. And basically what happens is they, uh, their adult form isn't necessarily as dangerous or as damaging as their caterpillar form. And what these caterpillars will do is they'll actually go and feed on uh, all of the leaves on a plant. And basically that can end up killing these plants because they're not getting any light, they're not taking advantage of photosynthesis. And so it can do be very damaging to a species as they spread across uh, the world. And so typically what we do is we'll try and keep these in check by treating for them as soon as we see any kind of signs of them. And again, it depends on what state you're in Pest control services typically work hand in hand with the forest department, with the Department of Agriculture to keep these pests in check. Now, again, they can spread very quickly. While you don't necessarily, like I said, need to worry about the adult form beyond the fact that they're going to continue to breed and multiply, but the caterpillar uh, larva form is more the dangerous one that is going to harm trees and cause a problem. So what do you do if you find these pests, if you find these bugs? Well, you want to alert the Department of Agriculture because again, that they should definitely know uh, so they can get involved and help treat for those. Uh, again, if you're overly concerned with them in your yard or protecting your plants and trees, again, these pests typically will attack things like aspen and oak trees, but they're not exclusive to those. So if you have those around your property, uh, you might be worried about them and wanna keep them safe. So you can certainly reach out to a pest control service to have your yard, your home treated. But in a lot of states, uh, they kind of work hand in hand with the Department of Agriculture. So again, if you happen to see any gypsy moths in either an adult form or their caterpillar form, toss up a picture here you can see what they look like in the caterpillar form uh, so if you see these around definitely like I said let the Department of Agriculture know reach out to your local pest control service if you're not sure if they go hand in hand with those but just letting people know uh, is definitely a great prevention step and then if you're overly concerned and you want to have your home uh, treated for these pests feel free to do that as well you can reach out to your local pest control service if the Department of Agriculture isn't going to be on top of that. Uh, like in some states, they, they definitely are on top of that. So again, uh, find out what goes on in your state specifically, but keep a lookout for these pests because again, left unchecked, they can do a lot of damage, do a lot of harm, do a lot of trees. And so we definitely want to get rid of them as soon as possible. So again, hopefully you got some benefit and value out of this video. If you did, feel free to comment and share and subscribe to our channel if you haven't. And if you do have pest control issues, feel free to reach out to us over at roguepestcontrol.com. And if you happen to be a first time customer, you can also get a $50 discount by going to roguepestcontrol.com forward slash 50 off and just fill out that information there and get $50 off your first service with us. But again, thanks so much for tuning in. We'll talk to you more soon.